welcome back to my channel. I am Miss Lauren Lee 11 and I am actually really excited to do this video today. Reason being is because as you can see, my hair is in a protective style. And for that reason, I've been wearing wigs. I've been trying out wigs just because I want something different. I mean, there's nothing wrong with this style. It's cute. It's kind of fuzzy right now because I've had it in for a while, but I'd wear this style, I'd rock this style, but it does, it takes some getting used to for me personally, because it shows me how small my head is. We're not even gonna get into that, guys. But what we're gonna get in today, guys, is the headband wig that I've been sent from my old world. Now, guys, for the longest, I have been avoiding a headband wig because when I'm wearing a wig, I like for people to guess. I like for people to try and wanna find out if it's actually my hair because they just look that good. <laughs> I don't want it to look wiggy, and I feel that the headband wig gives a wiggy look. Well, that's what I felt in the past. But I went on Pinterest and I've seen some headband wigs, straight, curly, what have you. They look so good, guys and they look hassle-free well they are hassle-free there's just no lace no glue no fuss i'm going to try it out today i'm going to show you the parcel that i received this is from mild wild and i received it in this cute super cute it looks like a diamond and a heart mixed together <laughs> box it's like a vanity box i've got their logo and it's got their their name there and guys they also sent me this cute little gift I like the logo on their box they've sent me this cute cute little gift i love it guys so we've got this little compartment here take out and you've got stocking cap you've got the mild wild instruction book all right so let's just get on to the wig guys because i know that's what you came here for so ta -da! so before i go into the wig i'm going to show you they gave me two headbands now these are not necessarily something i would usually wear they're a bit out there for me i don't like a lot of patterns because they look too busy or if i am going to wear a lot of patterns the rest of the outfit has to be plain so this wig is 100 percent human hair i believe it is 22 inches i'll leave the details down below in the description box and as you can see it's got a nice highlight to it now with the highlight i'm not 100 percent about the color i'm not 100 percent sure that it would suit me and not look wiggy but maybe once i straighten it and i style it it wouldn't look so bad if i'm not 100 percent with it because it is human hair it will be easy to dye so as you can see inside you've got two clips at the front very secure velcro and then you've got one clip at the back with two elastics this wig ain't going nowhere so the headband that they've got on there already which i like is black so that's nice but i'm not 100 percent keen on the shininess of it so i have also got my own black headband which i might put over it i've also got this gorgeous red headband with the bow on top i love this and i've also got my black headband i'm not too sure about this one guys because i've always think because i've got a long face i feel it makes my head look long i don't know all right, so first, I think I'm gonna try it with the camera showing, what do you think? Now guys, as I said, the Velcro is very strong. So you're gonna to wanna to maybe hold them whilst you're putting the wig on so it doesn't get stuck to all the hair. Especially if it's a curly wig, you might not want it to be ripping out all that hair. Ooh, oh, okay. Okay, so I was meant to show you the, the cameras. Okay, so can I ever do it like that? I think if my cameras were neater, I could get away with it. Oh, I think this color goes nice with the green. And I don't mind the headband too much. Okay, so in regards to the combs, I've just put the comb in at the back. I haven't, I'm not going to put the comb in the front because I don't want to drag my cameras if I don't need to. And this is on <laughs> securely, so. I'm gonna go and straighten it in a sec. You see what it looks like with a black headband. Let's try the long one, the long one, like that. Oh, that looks so cute. <gasps> Let's try the red one. <laughs> I literally look like I'm a Girl Scout. I thought the red was gonna be a bit overwhelming with this hair color. I think I actually like this hair color. So again, I think with these headbands, I'd have to, yeah. So with this one, I think I'd have to have my camera show in. But you don't have to have cameras, obviously, guys. You can even put your hair back in a bun, as I've seen others do, and that looks cute. So the main thing we need to do is work out, work on these edges. I think that looks cute already. I think I'm sticking with the red one. So let's do the edges and then I'm gonna go straighten out the hair just to give it some oomph, you know? 
because I've got a lot of fluffy edges, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna go all out with the edges today. If you see my video where I lay my edges with my Dax uh, hair pomade, I will be using that once my edges are properly laid, if you see what I mean. Right now they're very curly because they've been under a lace wig the whole time. I did not think I'd like this, guys. The fact that I don't have to glue, I can have my natural hair out of the front. If you want to go ahead to the Mild Wild website, click the link that I've given you because that will take you straight through to my discount code that you can buy this wig with. I think, let me change these areas because a lot is going on. Maybe I put in some simple hoops. Right, let me go straighten this out and I will be back in, in a sec. Hey guys, so I'm back now. As you can see, I've, I've kind of curled the ends. I tried. I didn't want to bump them too much, but I wanted them to have a little bit of body. I did bump this bit a bit much, so it looks like my head's puffy. Let's quickly show you the back. I haven't even looked at this myself, so I don't know what it looks like. As you can see, I needed to run a comb through my hair. Now this wig is very lightweight, guys. There is minimal shedding, like about, and I'm not even exaggerating, about two to three hairs as I was combing it. Hair is super soft, so easy to work with, curls lovely. I'm gonna keep this on all day, and this is gonna be my wig that I'm wearing now during my protective style. As I said, the only thing is with the color, I didn't think it would go too well with my skin tone, but, um. I like it. I don't know if it's because of the outfit that I'm wearing, because even without the red headband, I think it's so cute. But I'm, I don't think I'm going to dye this one, actually, guys, because I've got three black wigs already. And this is just nice. I love it. I actually really loved it. I love the colour. I thought it would look kind of um, a little bit tacky because I haven't seen myself in this type of colour before. But this is so yummy. So I folded the headband, by the way, the black one, just to cover it up. Yeah, so anyway, guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do want to purchase this wig, go and check out Mild Wild. You can click the link down below in the description box and it will take you to the link with my code on there, okay? If you have any comments or questions, I will answer them. <laughs> so I'll see you in the next one, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. I've got three. <laughs> Move you back a bit. There you go. So you get a wider scope, you know?